Memorial Day ceremonies happening all across the country today, honoring the military members who lost their lives serving our country. Here's how the Queen City paid their respects. It's the sound heard across the country and Carolinas Monday from Huntersville to Fort Mill. It is a day to honor their memory by striving to be worthy of the freedoms they secured for us. Services and ceremonies all honoring military members who made the ultimate sacrifice. It's a humbling day. Especially for the families of the fallen, like Gold Star wife Chris Rystrom Emmert, whose husband died while serving in the Navy in 1993. We don't do picnics. We don't go to barbecues, we don't go to special sales because it's a time of remembrance of the loss of someone that we love dearly. For others, it's a reminder of why so many continue to fight and serve. We don't really realize what we have. Most of us go around day by day and don't understand the freedom that we have. And Queen City first responders will be collecting new essential items for veterans in our area, along with the VA and American Red Cross. Go ahead and check out the QR code on your screen. That's where donations can be uh, made. And you can also drop off uh, them off at any Charlotte Fire Department, Charlotte Mecklenburg Police Department Division, Medic and Mecklenburg County Sheriff's Office until June 14th. You can follow that QR code or simply go to QCNews.com for detailed information on how you can donate. You can see the list of items that we're collecting. New items only, please. Monetary donations can also be made directly to the VA with a link on the site.